Get Your Ex-Wife Back After Divorce How to Get Your Ex-Wife Back and Build a New and Happy Relationship with Her It's important to pinpoint the reasons why you got divorced in the first place. This will help you become a better husband and be more attractive and interesting to your ex. There are certain pros in getting your wife back after some time has passed. Usually, the decision to file for divorce is preceded by a long path of contemplation for a woman. During this path, she harbors a lot of negativity, which prevents her from thinking clearly before she finally leaves. But once she finds herself alone, the negativity subsides, and she begins to reminisce about the good times she's had with her husband. She starts to miss him. Additionally, since some time has passed after the divorce, the chances are greater that she will believe in the possibility that her husband has changed for the better. Though there are two people in a marriage, many men blame their wives for everything, even when they want to reconcile. A husband will say that the marriage broke up because his wife did this and that, wasn't attentive enough, nagged him too much, etc. On the one hand, there's some truth to that, and no one is perfect. But on the other, if she left you and you want to get her back, you also made some mistakes that need to be corrected. For you to get her back, you need to figure out what those mistakes were, accept the fact that you made them, and clearly understand that you were also at fault for the breakup. Yes, the fault may not be fully yours because you may not have seen and understood what your wife was unhappy about. Nevertheless, at this moment, the responsibility to fix the relationship is on you. Since it's not always clear why a woman leaves, here's a simple exercise that will help you understand what may have happened. Write out 10 of your latest fights and the reasons why they occurred. Most likely, the reason that you see most often will be the one your relationship fell apart. I'm including a list of such possible reasons, so it's easier for you to try and figure out what it was in your case. Reason number one, the husband lost his attractive qualities, became too passive and boring. He has elevated his wife to a pedestal, but stopped taking care of himself. He thought that if he satisfies her needs, then the marriage will be a happy one. But women aren't interested in men who don't care about their own needs and become slaves. Of course, it feels nice when all her needs are satisfied but the man needs to be attractive and interesting, be the leader and initiator in what happens in a marriage. Such a man attracts women and makes them want to be with him. Reason number two, infidelity. If a man cheats on his wife, this often leads to the demise of the marriage. In this case, the woman feels unwanted, insulted, and hurt so she wants to get as far away from the man as possible and hurt him as much as he hurt her. Reason number three, financial problems. Most often, women don't leave a man when finances first become a problem. But if this continues for a long time and the husband doesn't take proactive steps to solve the problems, instead putting the burden on his other half, maybe drinking or spending too much time outside the home, the woman can't handle it and leaves. Reason number four. The man doesn't appreciate his wife and spends little attention on her. Many times, the man gets too involved in making money, running a business, or doing other things he finds important. Meanwhile, he forgets to pay attention to his wife, setting her emotional needs aside. There's an opinion in the society that if a man makes good money, then everything will be all right automatically. But that's a mistake. Any woman wants attention and for her husband to spend time with her. Expensive gifts and designer clothes won't satisfy all of her needs. 
even wearing a luxurious dress and holding a glass of expensive wine in her hands, a woman can be unhappy and cry because her husband is never home. By the way, this is when she may start looking for a man on the side to fill the void that has appeared in the relationship with her husband. Reason number five, intimate issues and problems with sex. This is often a reason that leads to a divorce. Now that you understand the reasons for the breakup, it's time to come up with a plan on how to get your wife back. I'd like to recommend a great website where I found a lot of information on how to get a wife back. Take a look. xback.how forward slash w. That's E-X-B-A-C-K dot H-O-W forward slash W. Here are the steps you should take. First, if you are actively communicating with her at the moment, you need to pull back and limit your contact for three to four weeks. Second, you need to work on your mistakes and start improving yourself. The reasons that you isolated will help you understand what those mistakes were and correct them. This, in turn, will get her interested in you again. How can you improve yourself? For example, if you realized that you didn't value your wife, started to actively try and get her back, showering her with flowers and gifts, but she still didn't take you back, you should know that it's because she doesn't believe that you've changed. She doesn't trust that you actually worked on yourself and aren't just chasing her now when the situation is critical. She thinks that if she lets you back in, you will fall back to your old ways and the negativity that prevailed in your old relationship will resurface. Here's an example. Imagine that you went to a good restaurant and your visit was great. You decided to go back there but the second time around, the service wasn't all that satisfactory and the food was bland. You complained and received a call from the restaurant manager offering you a discount if you come back. You trusted him, went back, and maybe even enjoyed the entree, but the main course was disgusting. The waiter was rude when you complained and refused to take back the food. So, you left hating the restaurant and being mad at yourself for trusting the manager, going back, and spending more money at the place you didn't like. The next day, you receive a call again. It's the manager, inviting you back and promising that everything will be different. Most likely, you won't trust him again, and you'll stay away. Something similar is happening to your wife. A mistake many men make is to just continue trying to get their woman back instead of working on themselves. This is similar to the restaurant manager convincing you to try the place again, but forgetting to actually fix the mistakes that were present during your two previous visits. Many men think that if they are successful at convincing the woman to give their relationship a chance, then everything will be great. But that's not so. To find out how to actually make your relationship work, you should read our book, Get Your Wife Back. We've included quite a few bonus articles that should help you in your quest. To get your wife back, you need to create an attractive image of yourself and show it to her in the right light. This is a new and improved version of yourself that will become a magnet for your ex, pulling her back stronger than any of your previous attempts. She won't believe you if you just come to her and say, My love, I've changed. Everything will be different. She may even cut you off, telling you to never contact her again. So you must act differently. I recommend the technique of indirect influence the essence of which is to demonstrate your changes through social media, her surroundings, and special stories. There are templates of such stories 
along with the detailed information on how to present them in the chapter on indirect influence in our book, Get Your Wife Back. You can find more information on the book by following the link below. If you have any questions, please write them in the comment section and I'll be happy to answer them as soon as possible. Please like and subscribe to our channel. This will help me and my team to create new materials and videos. Good luck at getting your wife back.